about those thanks again for tuning in to yet another video we are getting on the new heritage and this is the the brand new one the redesigned all blacked out as you can see 114 man this one looks good i like it i'm a fan of the overall look of this new heritage if you guys see my video where i spoke about the models i'm a fan of the overall look of this bike wow she feels great go ahead and turn her on Here we go. So we are in the first gear. Let's get going. I wanted to get on the uh, on the street, Bob, but somebody else already. Somebody else is waiting for it. Somebody has it on reserve, but they didn't even bring their damn helmet. I mean, wow. <laughs> you come to a demo event and you don't bring your own helmet. Yeah, I mean that's just that's something that you just don't do. So, let's see, we are on the Heritage 114, all blacked out. This is the new one, of course. And uh, yeah, the placement of the handlebars, you could obviously tell it's more of a casual, more of a relaxed feel. I'm not a big fan of them, because I mean, my hands are, my wrists, they're a little bit more inward compared to what I'm used to, but I don't know, it's just a, it's a funny feeling handlebar. I mean, for this sort of style, you're normally a little bit more lower, but it's like in between. It's like in between a, some uh, some mini apes and like buckhorn. Uh, yeah, it's just a little odd. It's a little different, but she still feels pretty good. I don't know how I like these little accents of chrome because there isn't much on it. This is the uh, blacked out Heritage 114. Uh, it's I guess the tank badging it's a little chromed out there but as far as chrome on the bike it's most of it is blacked out so this guy seems <coughs> so here we go yeah I mean she feels great of course 114 <coughs> Let's see. I gotta see if I'm used to this. <laughs> there you go. I'm getting used to the bike. Sorry, guys. Uh, yeah, the placement of the handlebars is just a little off. It's a little weird for me. But, uh, I mean, she feels great. You have the, the longer floorboards on here. It's a little bit more relaxed feel. Like I said, the handlebars itself. Something that you, you could probably get used to. It's just... I'm just used to having my taller bars and the placement of like I said man the, I don't know I just can't get used to it I just I just want to have my hands out a little bit more and not kind of having my elbows on the inside kind of like this I don't know what it is I just <laughs> I'm not used to it most of my bikes they've been a little bit different there goes the sports service I'm gonna try to get on that as well but uh, all in good time and uh, you know what I like the windshield that it has that same look of, uh, of my windshield on my on my metric cruiser I have that same uh, style of course I painted the the lower the bottom lower or the end I don't even know how you say it but uh, the lower end of it painted it just like that and I do like the overall look of the bike and uh, you have the, uh, the bigger saddlebags on here of course it's a soft tail it's not a touring bike you guys remember uh, what was it, in 2020 on 2021 they switched this to the uh, to a touring bike for some reason but uh, it's not it's a it's a soft tail it's got the soft tail frame it's not a tour uh, you know it's got the monoshock so it's not uh, it's not the same so let's just go ahead and build up some speed here I like the windshield so far it's been a lot better than the speed screen on the the lowrider is she handles great i'm gonna try to close my windshield uh buffering wise there isn't any uh just just overall just noise you know just noise uh i don't my head's not shaking or anything like that it looks pretty good even just being here in the pocket i don't know if you guys could get used to having the uh the edge of the glass and your point of view my eye my eyesight at five seven 
is actually just above it so I'm not I'm not looking through the glass and I'm not looking at the edge so so far the placement of the windshield is great I don't know how tall the windshield is but uh, I, I do like it it's a, it's a, it's obviously shorter than my metric one for sure because my metric is like all the way up here and on my metric uh, on my on my glass windshield I'm looking right through it so that's not the case here uh, we are now doing you know a little bit <laughs> 70 miles per hour but <coughs> <coughs> Anyways, we're doing higher speeds and you know what? The windshield is great. Um, it feels a lot better than the, uh, than the other bikes for sure, but uh, let's go ahead and slow down here a little bit. Uh, here we go. I'm looking forward on getting one of these other bikes, but uh, so far the Heritage feels great. I guess the only thing I would change is just the uh, the handlebars. I mean, that's one thing that's gonna have to go. But let's go ahead and get up to speed here and see how she handles. Of course, the windshield, the frame. I'm gonna let this guy get ahead of me. He seems like uh, I was I was holding him back quite a bit. But uh, let's go ahead and build up some speed here. So that's pretty much the downward ride for the Heritage. Man, this bike is beautiful. I, I really do like it. Even though it's not my style, it's far away from it. Uh, but man, I really like what they did to it. That little modern take on it. I mean, it's not too drastic. It still has a lot of classic lines. It still has a lot of classic lines, but uh, they just updated it just a little bit. Not, you know, just enough to really, man, to, to really, you know, to really just change it from from the earlier models and they changed it just a tad bit and in my opinion it works i really like this this heritage the way it looks the wheels the blacked out 114 uh, i just you know i just can't get around the placement on the handlebars it's just one of those things that uh, i would have to you know change I, you know it's just maybe more of a street bob feel to it or I don't know what it is. You guys just, you know, stay out there, stay safe. Don't believe everything you read. Life's a risk. Get out there and ride. Later.